Hello, my name is Opara E. J. Z. A. Kinsley. You're welcome to my channel 10 Starship. In this channel, we talk about finance, loans, grants, scholarship, travels, employment, recruitment, business ideas, and many more. Today, I'll be discussing and be talking about fresh, current, new NASA microfinance bank loans you can apply and assess today. That is current, fresh NASA microfinance bank loans you can assess today. So, to begin, we have subtopics and they include how much you can assess from any of these loan schemes. Two, interest rates. So we're talking about their, uh, their interest rate. Three, we're talking about the moratorium. Four, their repayment period. Five, how to apply for these loans. And then lastly, where to get NASA Microfinance Bank near you. So to begin with these loan uh, schemes, let us let me remind you that NASA Microfinance Bank is well known for disbursing federal government intervention funds. If you could remember, you know, um, COVID-19 loan, COVID-19 SME loan, COVID-19 household, Axe Mix, Nigerian Youth Investment Fund, you know, these loans we are disbursed through NASA Microfinance Bank. So, from these loan schemes that I've been introducing today, you can assess from 300,000 to millions of naira. So let me take you through these loan schemes and then you make your own choice. Please, if you have not subscribed to this channel, subscribe now, like, comment, and share. So the first loan scheme that I've been introducing you to is called Salad. Salad. Okay, Salad, the full meaning of Salad is a um, salary advance now this loan is specially designed for government salary earners that is to say the loan is meant for civil and public servants that is the truth it's not for everybody it's not for everybody so if you are a government worker and you need a quick loan please come for this loan you will easily assess it now the question is how much can you assess from salad loan while interacting with one of the staff today i was told that only 300,000 naira can be obtained now okay so if you are going for any of the for now you can only uh, uh, get 300,000 naira from them but with time the facility will increase now there is no collateral security needed for this loan so you don't need collateral you don't need any security just come and get it if you belong to the aforementioned category now number two loan scheme we're talking about is called petty cash now now petty cash now now the petty cash is designed for artisans and petty traders so via this um loan scheme one can obtain 500,000 naira and below without security and CSE certificate so without um, security when we talk about security please we're talking about collateral when we talk about security uh, uh, it means that as we're trying to say that without security sorry and CSE you can get up to 500,000 naira and below but you must fall into this category artisan or a petty trader okay let's go to the number three loan scheme this loan scheme is for entrepreneurs okay it's called sme loan this is mainly for small medium enterprises so via this scheme you can assess at least to one million naira or above now there are conditions attached to this loan to assess uh, anything above 1 million naira you know from this loan scheme you must provide security worth at least 220% of the facility to be taken 
So in this case, for instance, if you are if you are borrowing one million naira, the security, the collateral that you're going to be providing is not uh, going to be hundred percent. You're not going to it should be one million. As in the what the current value should not be one million. It should be at least one point two million naira. So if you are going for one million naira, to so be very uh, just provide any uh, collateral that is worth 1.2 million naira okay 1.2 million naira that's 120 percent of the facility to be taken so this security could actually include you know vehicles could also include land and many more now we have talked about these three loan schemes we talked the first one we talked about uh, salad the second one we talked about petty cash now now and then the third one we talked about the sme loan now these here are the major conditions of these loans before you assess this any of these uh, loans you must have in mind these following the moratorium unfortunately there is no grace period for all these loans so once you collect it you start paying back the next month so there is no moratorium at all given to you for this loan unlike the other ones covid 19 you have so good and the rest once you click and stay for like one year before start paying back but this one you don't have you know uh, such grace so if you collect it you start paying back the next month then the second one is interest the interest rate for all these loans is 23 percent per annum and this is very good this simply means that the interest rate to be paid back monthly is 1.9 percent monthly 1.9 percent 1.9 percent monthly i must confess this is very good this is very very good so um for instance if you borrowed one million naira your interest every month will be nineteen thousand. that's 1.9 percent 1.9 percent your interest okay will be uh, for uh, monthly will be nineteen thousand. now let's look at the repayment period again you have only one year just one year to pay back the borrowed fund so it's not like the other ones where you have you you, you had up to like three years and some of them even five like they are mixed five to seven years this one is just one year so now the next thing is how do you apply for this loan this loan you don't apply it online you don't do it like the other ones the application is done you know physically so you have to visit any Nessa microfinance bank near you and then create an account with them before you can assess this loan. So why going to Nassau Microfinance Bank near you? Please go with current UTB, passport, valid ID card, and 5,000 Naira. When we talk about valid ID card, it includes permanent voters card, um, NIN, NIN, sorry, driver's license, international passport and then the next question is where can you locate nasa microfinance bank near you the question is very simple please if there is any post office near you kindly walk into that post office you will see nasa microfinance bank my name remains opara ej zekesli if you have not subscribed subscribe like comment and share God bless you.